With my birthday just passed and the first snowfall blanketing the world in fresh white here, it seems the perfect opportunity to record this reflection, which is the end of the second year worth and the beginning of the third. I would be lying if I told you that this past year has been an easy one. My mother-in-law was diagnosed with cancer on Christmas Eve and it kind of seemed to go downhill from there. My grandmother passed away. Our basement flooded. My father's heart started being silly. And that's just the bare edges of what's happened over this past year. However, through it all, God has been strengthening our faith giving us wisdom and courage and peace beyond understanding, growing my little family together in ways that would never have been possible otherwise. Truly, God is good all the time. In fact, much of what we have been going through over this past time has been the basis for the reflections that I have been sharing with you. To borrow from Paul, I do thank God with every remembrance of all of you, and I pray for you each time. I trust that he has proven himself true over and over again to you as well. He always gives us more than we can handle on our own. And then he shows us how we don't have to handle it by ourselves at all. By the way, my mother-in-law, who should be gone by now, grows stronger in health and faith daily. My grandmother was saved, so I know that she's with Jesus. Our basement will be fixed soon and is 100% covered by the insurance. My dad is fine and has boggled even the doctors. And believing that the Lord is doing more than we even know about. So under this fresh blanket of snow, as we start a new time of reflections, continue to reflect on truly how good God is, how he does so many things, not in the ways that we would ever want or understand, but in ways that bring about a better answer than even we could have ever dreamed of. Truly, God is good all the time. Blessings.